Okay guys, so let's get started with the makeup tutorial part. I've already prepped my skin with vitamin C serum, moisturizer and sunscreen. So the first step is to use the foundation and I'm using this foundation by Clinique in the shade Warm Beige. And this is a great foundation, especially for any festive event as it has full coverage and it lasts long. I'm using foundation brush to blend the foundation. And you can see how flawless my skin is turning out to be. Next, I'm using concealer by LA Girl in the shade Peach under my eyes and I'm blending it with a damp beauty blender. Always remember that you use damp beauty blender, otherwise it soaks up the product and it doesn't give you ample coverage. You can also put it on any other blemishes that you may have. Next, I'm using an eyeshadow primer as you'll be dancing all night. So you do want your eyeshadow to stay in place. And for this, I'm using Original Eyeshadow Primer by Urban Decay and blending it with my fingers. Next step is to define the eyebrows. I'm using my favorite eyebrow pencil by MAC in the shade Spite. I love that how easy it is to create well-defined eyebrows using this eyebrow pencil in a matter of minutes. And I absolutely love this pencil. Next, we move on to the eyeshadow palette. Since this is a festive look, I've opted for a bright eyeshadow palette and I'm starting off with the shade Art Deco all over the lid and I'm using this fluffy brush to put it on the lid. Next, I'm putting the shade Artist on top of it and near the crease to create the transition effect. and then blend it out with a fluffy brush. Next, I'm using a concealer again to cut the crease on my lid so I can put a bright color on it and I think it's a really good technique. Then I'm putting the shade outside the line to put it on top of it and it matches with my blouse and oh my god, do you see how pretty this shade is looking? Then to add further more dimension to my outer corner of the eye, I'm using the shade DIY and then I blended everything with a fluffy brush so there are no harsh lines. Next I'm again using the shade Artist to put it outside the waterline to create a smoky effect. I also have green in my lehenga so I'm using the shade Color Explosion and putting it in the center to create a nice blue and green combination. And then I'm using the shade Inspiration to put it in the inner corner of my eyes and also on my brow bone to create an highlighting effect. Then I'm using this Urban Decay Eyeliner in brown to fill my waterline as well as draw an eyeliner. I don't like black these days as I really feel that brown softens up your eyes. Then I'm using the Maybelline Loose Setting Translucent Powder to set my makeup to prevent it from creasing. I mean, it's my favorite powder. I've said it before in a different tutorial because it really, like I said, binds your makeup and does not accentuate your fine lines. Then I'm using a lip liner to draw my lips using Maybelline Lip Pencil and I'm also filling my lips with this lip liner. I think it's a really good technique again because you want to prep your lips before you actually put the lipstick. And then I'm putting Milani lipstick in Spice to fill my lips. And then I'm using the MAC lip gloss again in the color Spice. And I'm putting it in the middle of my lips because this technique gives you the appearance of fuller lips. Next time is to add some contour to the face. I'm using Hula Beauty Bronzer by Benefit to contour. And then I'm using the Sephora blush in date night to add a flush of pink to my cheeks. Finally, I'm putting highlighter. It's funny how I never used to put highlighter and now I'm absolutely addicted to highlighter as it totally makes you glowy and gives you the appearance of super healthy skin.
Now I'm applying mascara. I love mascara as even if you don't have any eye shadow, no makeup, just putting mascara makes you look so refreshed. Makes you look like you've really had 8 hours of sleep. Isn't that awesome? <laughs> And again, this is a festive Daniel look. I want to keep the look desi. I'm using a yellow bindi and a nose ring to complete the look. And finally, I'm using a liquid eyeliner to draw three dots on both sides of my face.